Welcome back to Infigyan my dear friends. In today's video we are having one very interesting Diophantine equation for positive integer solutions. Equation is cube root of x cube plus y cube plus 30xy equal to 10. So let's get started by writing our equation cube root x cube plus y cube plus 30xy equal to 10. Now I will consider cubing both sides. So power 3, power 3. Now I can cancel cube with cube root. So I can write our LHS as x cube plus y cube plus 30xy equal to 10 cube. Take all the term to LHS. I can write x cube plus y cube minus 10 cube plus 30xy equal to 0. Now I will use manipulation x cube plus y cube plus minus 10 whole cube we can write plus of minus 10 and whole cube and this 30xy we can write as minus 3 times x times y times minus 10 equal to 0. Now if I will plug in here x equal to a, y equal to b and c equal to or minus 10 equal to c, then we will have one algebraic identity. Let me write here, it would be a cube plus b cube plus c cube minus 3a b c. We know this identity equal to half times a plus b plus c. In other bracket, it is a minus b whole square plus b minus c whole square plus c minus a whole square. Now you can see if I will apply x equal to a, y equal to b and minus 10 as c, then this will come out. So I will use its right hand side. So let me write our LHS as per this identity. Let me write here x cube plus y cube plus minus 10 whole cube minus 3 times x times y times minus 10 equal to 0. Now I will use half times a plus b plus c. So a is x, b is y, c is minus 10. In other bracket I can write a minus b so x minus y whole square, b minus c so I will write y plus 10 whole square, c minus a then I will write minus 10 minus x whole square and right hand side is 0. Now we need to write two equations from here as this product is 0. So I will write our first equation x plus y minus 10 equal to 0. From here we will be writing x plus y equal to 10. Now second equation the sum of squares. So I will be writing here x minus y whole square plus y plus 10 whole square plus minus let me write here x plus 10 whole square because minus 1 raised to the power 2 it will be 1 whole square equal to 0. Now we will solve these two equations one by one. Let me consider the very first equation which is x plus y equal to 10. Let me write x plus y equal to 10. So for integer solution only, if I will write, then I will write 0 plus 10, 1 plus 9, 2 plus 8 will be 10, 3 plus 7 will be 10, 4 plus 6 will be 10, 5 plus 5 will be 10, 6 plus 4 will be 10, 7 plus 3 will be 10, 
8 plus 2 will be 10, 9 plus 1 will be 10 and 10 plus 0 will be 10. If I will consider non-negative solutions. So because of only positive solutions we are looking for, we will reject these two values. So let me write our ordered pairs x comma y it would be 9 values 1 comma 9 first one then second one is 2 comma 8 third ordered pair will be 3 comma 7 fourth ordered pair i will write 4 comma 6 5 comma 5 6 comma 4 7 comma 3, 8 comma 2 and last ordered pair it would be 9 comma 1. How many ordered pairs are there? 9. 9 ordered pairs are there in our answer. Now equation number 2 is left. Let us consider equation number 2. So I will write here x minus y whole square plus y minus 10 it is y plus 10 whole square x plus 10 whole square equal to 0. Sum of 3 squares will be 0 if and only if individual brackets this bracket will be 0 for real solutions. So I will write here three equations. Let me write 1, 2 and 3. x minus y equal to 0. First bracket 0. y plus 10 equal to 0. Third equation x plus 10 equal to 0. What conclusion I will write? Conclusion will become x equal to y equal to minus 10. So, one ordered pair will generate from here and it would be with negative integers. Minus 10, comma, minus 10. But we are looking for only positive integers. So, I will write here rejected. So, overall there are only 9 solutions, 9 ordered pairs. Let me write. 9 ordered pairs. So I will be writing here x comma y. First value I will write 1 comma 9. Second ordered pair will be 2 comma 8, 3 comma 7, 4 comma 6, 5 comma 5, 6 comma 4, 7 comma 3, 8 comma 2 and last value, last ordered pair will be 9 comma 1. So 6 plus 3 there are overall 9 solutions and this brings the end of this video. I hope you will like this video. Thank you friends for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.